everyone! How are you all doing? How is your 2016 going? Mine is going well. Um, it's been a while since I've made a video, I know. I think it's just because like with the holidays and everything I was really busy and a lot of stuff was going on. But now I'm back and I have new glasses, so that's cool. Anyway, so today I thought I would do a, I guess, kind of t-shirt haul, kind of what I got for Christmas because mainly all I got for Christmas was t-shirts because that's all I asked for. I asked for a couple other things which I got, but that's not, that's not part of this. So since every single day I wear t-shirts, like every time I'm at home I'm wearing something with a printed pattern on it, so I thought that I would make a video about it because I figure I'm probably not the only one who lives in t-shirts and I thought I would share them in case you're looking for some new ones. So I have all them here. Um, half of them are what I got for Christmas and then half of, half of them are the ones I got for Christmas and then the other half are ones that I bought with my Christmas money. So I put them into, I guess, sections so we're going to start with the random ones that I got. So the first one on top, as you guys know, I love Impractical Jokers. So of course I had to get the Where's Larry t-shirt. Isn't it cool? I like it. It's also very soft. So uh, Also, I will tell you guys where I got everything. I just almost choked, but that's okay. Um, so this one, I think you just go on True TV and then you can find it pretty easily. Okay, next, I haven't watched the show yet, but I know when I watch it, I'm going to like it, and I wanted to get it because it was the best one that I saw, and it was in my size, Rick and Morty, I know, everyone loves it, and I need to watch it, and I will, but I got that at Hot Topic if you want to also get it, and this one I was super excited about because I have like two other Dumb and Dumber shirts that I haven't worn yet because, I don't know, they just have like a giant print, of, a, a giant picture of Lloyd's face with some random quote and I feel weird about wearing it for some reason because I just feel like it's so awkward and giant but this one I felt good about. If you know it, you'll understand it. Um, you can read it, but <laughs> I was going to read it but then I was like, oh, well, you can read it. Anyway, I got that also at Hot Topic which I love. All of these, basically, every single shirt I buy, I get it either Hot Topic or Redbubble. So, there you go. This one also is from Hot Topic. I haven't worn it yet because when I tried it on, it was really tiny. Like, for some reason, they're women's shirts. Even if I get it in a large, they're still really tight. So, I don't know. I still like it, though. Crimson Peak. If you haven't seen the movie yet, you need to when it comes out because... It's very entertaining, and Tom Hiddleston is the best. Okay, so moving into another section, which would be Gravity Falls. So, I've really recently gotten into Gravity Falls. I've always liked it, and I always watched it. Like, if I didn't see anything else that I really wanted to watch, and I saw it on, I was like, oh, I'll watch Gravity Falls. But recently, I've really gotten into liking it. I don't know why. Don't ask me. Um... But anyway, so I got this one. It's Mabel, and it's adorable because she's the best. I also have a dipper one that says, like, be warb. I haven't seen that episode yet, but I still liked it. And I have this one. You can barely see it. I like it. It's, um, pretty cool. But I got that one from Hot Topic, if I didn't say, and this one is from Redbubble, obviously. Okay. Moving into the YouTuber section, because obviously I had to ask for YouTuber t-shirts. And I'm just realizing that I'm going to have to refold all these. Oh well. Okay. So first up, which seems to be too big for some reason. I guess all my shirts are kind of oversized. But anyway, this one, it's got Edgar. I love it. He's so chubby. Anyway, so yeah, it's kind of big, but whatever. I just got that one, or I looked for it, I didn't get it. Got it for Christmas, but either way, um, I think if you just go like PewDiePie merch, then you'll be able to find that one. Either way. So this one's from Redbubble, and never have I had a shirt that so perfectly explained who I am. 
As you guys probably know, I love Markiplier, so I had to get this. Isn't it the best? I was gonna get it in like gray or something, but then I was like, hey, I don't have any green shirts. I'll get green. Um, red bubble, if I didn't say. I think I did. I'm not sure. Okay. Other one, which is also from Red Bubble. It's so cute. Look at it. The Legend of Markiplier saving Tiny Box Tim. Um, I think it's cute. I think it was just like Tim's birthday or something. I don't know. It came on Twitter and everybody was wishing him happy birthday, so I did the same. Okay, and then the next one, I didn't get it for Christmas and I didn't get it for my with my Christmas money, I keep almost choking, don't mind me, <laughs> but either way, I didn't get it with my Christmas money either, but I thought I would add it because I got it at December, so anyway. And it's my first Markiplier's Hero shirt. Look at that. Look at it. You can't really see it, but that's okay. Anyway, so here it is. It's the King of the Squirrel shirt, and I love it so much. He, um was selling them and then giving to, I think it was Doctors Without Borders. Correct me if I'm wrong. If you know when I'm wrong, correct me because I could be, but I'm pretty sure that's what it was. And I was like, I need a Markiplier's Hero shirt because I don't have one, plus it, the money is going to a good cause. So there you go. Okay, next up is the Five Nights at Freddy's. Also, I don't think he's selling those anymore. I'm sorry if I just made you want one and you couldn't get one, but you can look for it if you want. He might still be. Either way. Okay, next up is the Five Nights at Freddy's shirts, and all of these, yeah, all of these are from Hot Topic. So, I don't know. I love Five Nights at Freddy's, and I saw that they were selling the shirts for them, and I went a little crazy, just a little bit. <laughs> I got basically every shirt that they had, but either way. So, this is the first one. There's so much on it though, and it's so pretty. <laughs> how could I not want this? Look how cute. I love it. Okay, next up is this one, which I think there was, yeah, there was that one and this one, and my dad wasn't sure which one I was asking for, so he got me both, but I love both, so it doesn't matter. And then there's this one. It's so cute. Well, not cute, I guess, because there's <laughs> blood everywhere, but it's still pretty cool. Okay, this one is probably one of my favorites because it's like you got the flyer for it. Help Wanted, come be a part of the new face of Freddy Fazbear Pizza. What could go wrong? If you know Five Nights at Freddy's, you know exactly what could go wrong. Okay, and then the last one, which I haven't worn yet because the sleeves are kind of funky and it doesn't fit right, but I wish I could because Bonnie is my favorite character. Look how cute she is, though. I think this is kind of like the Bonnie that would be in um, Five Nights at Freddy's 4. Also, my cupcake. <laughs> Five Nights at Freddy's 4 because, like, she's all tiny and cute, but then she turns bad. As I'm standing here, I'm being stared at by this Freddy. Isn't it cute? I got it at Target if you want it. But yeah, all those were from Hot Topic, so. Anyway, that's my t-shirt haul, I guess, plus my half what I got for Christmas. So if you guys have any questions about any of them or where I got any of them, obviously I told you all of it, but still, if you're wondering anything, just go ahead and ask me down in the comments or if you have any of these shirts, I guess. And I'm going to spend the next half hour refolding all of them. I don't even know how many I got. Like I was counting all of them and I was like, I didn't even know I asked for this many for Christmas, but I did. Plus, I bought a whole bunch more, which I probably didn't need, but obviously I did need. So anyway, um, I love you guys. I really do. I hope you're having a great 2016, and I know I am. And if you're not, you still have 11 months to make this year amazing. So I love you guys. I really do. And I will see you in the next random video. Bye.